Like, so, so now anybody can sit down with a language model and come up with a text solution because the government asks for a hundred pages of approach on how you're going to build software or how you're going to do whatever. And the people that write that are not usually the software developers. So there was always this big handoff of who says what and how do you write it? And are the people that came up with this solution the ones that are going to show up and do it? When you go with a, a small business, we're the ones that are talking about it. And, and we're the ones that show up, you know, the, um, uh, one of the times that uh, one of the programs that I won that was in Fort Benning and, you know, I, I wrote the thing and I showed up and they said, now, I don't know if you've seen this before. And I'm like, no, I, I wrote that. That's <laughs> me. Like, yeah, I, and uh, it's because when she, she liked one of the graphics in it and had her pinned on her cubicle and she was excited about that. And I was like, that makes me really happy because I drew that. Uh, so, so there, I, I think the only way you combat the idea of, how do you make sure that this person did this is you got to have them stand in front of you or in front of you on video. And so these people that are supposed to show up and do the work are the ones that tell me how they're going to do it. And then I can ask them questions. I think that's, I think we might see more and more of that because you're right. Like we could all sit down and crank out whatever we could have GPT write us an approach to anything. And um, whether it works or not, we don't know, but it's credible and can score well.